Hey, what's up, what's up, what's up, people? My name is Solomon Lange, and you're watching Aqua TV. God bless you. Hello, everyone. My name is Ochaya Ojofu. I am the founder of Aquea Children Carnival. Watch Aquea TV. I'm Veronica Ochidu. I'm Veronica Ochidu. TV. I'm Aquea TV. Wanima, you must see Pius or Guklo. Kagayo Udomo Chakuya. Gagayo Aquea TV. Aquea TV. Gaya Aquea TV. Kagayo Domo Chakuya. Kagayo Mil Yambo Nakuya. Gagaya Aquea TV. Anya. Hello and welcome to Aquea TV, the station that brings you history, art, culture, and development. I am Idajo Aja, and this is Aquea TV News Bulletin. The Vice Chancellor of Federal University of Health Science, Sotoko Professor Innocent Uja, has pledged to make the newly established Federal University of Health Science, Sotoko, a world class institution and a center of excellence in all ramifications. This is said in a short interview and response as Aquea TV visited to deliver a leadership award to the Professor of Medicine on Friday the 14th of May 2021 at the temporary site of the school in Otada, Otoko local government area of Benue State. Aquea TV bestowed on Professor Uja Aquea TV award for his historic appointment as Pioneer Vice Chancellor, Federal University of Health Science, Otoko. Professor Uja also said that all is set for construction to begin at the permanent site of the university, a 600 hectare piece of land located at Akwete Akba in Otoko local government area of Benue State. He showed Akwea TV crew the site plan for the first phase of construction covering 200 hectares of the land. The Vice Chancellor stated that the university has already established about 13 research centers, including research centers for infectious disease to also prove a solution to the outbreak of COVID-19, with highly qualified professionals drawn from all over the world. Admission is ongoing for intending students into the university. Students who scored 200 and above in their jam have been called upon to apply by checking the school admission website. The managing director of Aquaya TV Limited, Mr. Diego Odo Okenyodo, has called on well meaning individuals, groups, and organizations to join in making this year's Aquaya Children's Carnival a success by donating towards the event. Odo made this statement on Monday, the 17th of May 2021, when he, on behalf of Aquaya TV, donated books worth 300,000 naira to the organizers of Aquaya Children's Carnival. Um, I'd like to welcome the Aquaya uh, Carnival team to uh, is uh, Aquaya TV. Um, we are here to make this uh, donation to the good work that um, Aquaya Carnival is doing in terms of promoting children uh, and promoting their development, their academic development and their intellectual creativity. We believe at Aquaya TV that education is at the core of the development of a community and at the same time art, culture, creativity contributes to how far that um, education can go in terms of pushing the community forward. So we really appreciate what you are doing and um, we are calling on uh, different persons to support the work that um, Aquea Children's Carnival is doing in promoting, they should donate books, they should um, donate prizes, and do 
all um, manner of things. And we do hope that different people are doing this in their different ways. A second call we want to make is to other people in terms of supporting the development of children generally. Um, as a society, we haven't shown very well that we are that children are the leaders of tomorrow. We say it, but we don't act it. So just like Aquia uh, uh, Carnival is doing, we will believe that different communities should start um, doing uh, stuff and different programs and activities that will allow children to express their creativity, express their um, beliefs, you know, and knowledge. So we also use this opportunity to call on uh, well-meaning individuals and companies to um, support activities that will um, increase the intellectual development of children. So on behalf of Aquaria TV Limited, uh, I would like to present all of these uh, books to you, to the Aquaria Carnival uh, event that is holding on the 27th of May. The ceremony which hosted the pioneer and organizer of Aquaria Children's Carnival, Mrs. Ochanya Ojofu, took place at the headquarters of Aquaria TV, Guarimpa Abuja. Mrs. Ojofu, in response, expressed great joy and gratitude to Aquaria TV for the books. She added that this year's carnival, which comes up on Thursday, the 27th of July, 2021, has some line up of exciting events like cultural dance, singing, and many other competitions. Thank you so much, sir. We are really grateful for this. I'm sure the children will be thrilled to see all this, especially the cartoon characters, the book, the storybooks. I'm sure they'll really be happy to receive all this. We are so grateful. And to everyone that have reached out to us in one way or the other, we say thank you. But the thing is, there's so much to be done. We have a lot of work at hand, and we still seek support from as many people as possible with interest of children at heart. Like I always say, children is everybody's responsibility. The children we see today, they are the ones that become adults tomorrow. And if we don't take care of the children, it's it will our tomorrow is not sure as a society so we need to train up the children the way they should go and the way they grow they will never depart from it so we are really grateful for this god bless aquaria tv and long live we'll start with the match pass for both secondary and primary and then we have um cultural display from different schools and then we have speech from smart kids from each of the school that is invited and we also have a um, quiz general knowledge on aquaria and current affairs in general and we have artwork presentation also so many things <laughs> to be done for this. and those are the stories we're tracking at this hour on aquaria tv for more updates do visit our website at www.aquiatv.com do also follow and like aquaria tv on facebook Twitter, LinkedIn, and Instagram. Do stay with us and enjoy more programs on Aquaria TV. I am Idajo Aja. Bye for now.